I'm Mike Bailey. I'm here in Jordan with uh, the World Vision Syrian Refugee Crisis Response Team. The refugee crisis has grown very big on us very quickly. In the last three months, the number of refugees has doubled. The total number of refugees leaving Syria has passed a million. Now, the response of the uh, host governments, like the government of Jordan, uh, and of the humanitarian community, has been stretched almost to breaking point. And there are now more than 10,000 new refugees leaving Syria every day. Many refugees are living in uh, refugee camps in Jordan. The main camp is now home to twice the number of refugees that it was designed for. And this means serious overcrowding and not enough services. This puts children at risk of epidemic disease, especially as it gets warmer uh, as we go into the summer. Uh, and uh, it adds to the stress that they've already experienced. More than half the refugees in Jordan are living with host Jordanian communities. Uh, their parents are struggling to meet the cost of rent and other bills and uh, the accommodation that they're living in is often inadequate and very overcrowded. Parents are struggling to uh, get their children into Jordanian schools because often they, they lack the information they need and they need help with the cost of uh, uniforms and of school books. The influx of 100,000 new job seekers puts uh, extra pressure on Jordanians, especially where uh, unemployment is already high. Rents are pushed up by uh, the influx of Syrian refugees and uh, services like education and health are much more crowded in areas where the refugees are staying. World Vision and other humanitarian agencies works with uh, Syrian refugees and with Jordanian host communities to try and soften the effect that these changes have. World Vision is planning to work with Syrian refugees in the new refugee camp that will be opening in the next few weeks. Uh, we will be doing food programs, uh, water and sanitation programs and child protection. We will also be working with Syrian refugees in Jordanian host communities uh, in large population centres where Syrian refugees are congregating. There we'll be doing child protection and water and sanitation programmes including improvements to schools used by Syrian refugees uh, and the Jordanian host children and uh, accommodation.